So I just fired up my game and I realized that vampires is, I'm sorry, not vampires, werewolves um, are here. Um, I was just going to settle in for a nice evening of random building, random anything. But I decided to take a look at what this pack has to offer. Uh, so as you can see, I have most of the Sims content, um, you know, except for these particular game packs. I just have no real interest in buying them, and I'm probably not also going to buy werewolves, but let's reserve judgment until we see what some of the items are that they have um, on display. So here are some of the promotional images. And again, one of the things I noticed right off the bat, except for this adorable toddler, None of it is standing out to me or screaming to me. Oh, I want that. I have to have that right now. And this especially is just terrifying. I, I don't know. I, I just, I don't. <laughs> it's just not for me. I don't have words. Uh, anyway, let's take a look at uh, some of the other information here. We have the create a sim items. And you can see that they have um, a variety of hairstyles and things. But honestly, they're all very tacky and not my style, and I don't see myself using any of them. Um, some of these outfits just look like outfits that we already have. I, I'm not really... it's just... Ugh. Um, there's more jewelry and things, which, I mean, I, it's, I just don't. <laughs> I just don't. Um... Here's some, uh, you know, more clothes. I can, I can imagine the swatches that they used as the basis or the foundation for like making these quote unquote, like new items here in this pack. Like I can just see, I can breathe and feel like in my core, which items they used, um, to make these items. And so none of them are exactly standing out to me as unique. None of them are exactly standing out to me as something that I wanted. Actually, this thing right here is uh, kind of cool. We don't have anything like that in the game. Uh, they have these body marks and things, which I guess for some people it's, it's going to be outstanding and wonderful. And yeah, I really want that, but it's not my thing. Um, more facial scars. You know, a lot of those came in the Get Famous pack and I never used those. It's just not necessary for me and my kind of gameplay style. Um, you know, a lot of these items, they have to show off on the new things, you know, you have wolves this time. So why not show that we have these new things like that? Like, you know, piercings and stuff are wolves as well, but it's just not new. The items here as well, for example, we already have trunks. Like I, you know, these little planter things are kind of interesting for me, but not enough to buy a pack. You know, we already have tires and like things that are related to that, like this kind of log and this desk and chair, like this, these things are just not, none, nothing in this line is standing out to me as like, oh, I really need that right now. These little cluttery items are kind of cute. They're unique, but I don't need another guitar. I don't need a, what is that, telescope? This thing right here, I want to know more about though. That looks fascinating to me. Like, can you go in there and do things in there? Or like, what is that supposed to be? I, I, I can't tell what it is and I'm fascinated. But I don't need this. There's another planter. Like, why would you have another planter? Like, really? <laughs> like, seriously? Um, you know, these little items here are just... This whole line is just nothing that I want in my game or need in my game. This little barrel thing that we have already. The... Uh, what do you call this? Oh, they have these, like, all these little scratchy marks on things. And I guess that's something that... It, I guess it's like a selling point for this pack. It's just like, oh, look at the scratches and things like that. And I'm just like, ugh. I have a lot of that stuff in Vampires, and um, I'm happy with what I got in Vampires. And of course, they have to have a new crib for the new occult type. Um, but like this bar and things like that, we already have. Oh, you gave me four scratches instead of three. What's this doll? Actually, yeah, let's find out more about this doll. Are there any interactions with the doll? That'd be kind of cool, because we can't interact with like dolls in the game. That's something new, you know what I mean? Um, but anyway, here's some of the basic information about uh, the world or whatever. I guess there is a new world. We can... I, I can't check it out because I haven't bought the pack, but we can at least take a look at what the animation looks like. Okay, so if you hover over it, it looks like, yeah, basically the scratching. That's just the whole thing. It's representative of the pack. Like this is like the little lovebirds kissing is representative of the pack. Yeah, it's all right. But nothing... I, I don't need it. <laughs> I don't know about how you guys feel. I'm very curious to see how you feel about it. But honestly, for me, I mean... Even if it were on sale, 
I mean, a lot of the other packs had at least something that I thought was interesting. Um, but unfortunately, I'm just, this is, mm, this is just not my thing. Um, but I am curious to know how you all feel about it. Um, if you're excited about it because it's a, it's a new occult type and you've been waiting for a new occult type for a long time and finally we got something new. Um, if you like this kind of 90s kind of grunge kind of look and you're so excited to have that on your characters and your game, you know, especially for your uh, decade challenges and things like that, maybe that's what you're looking forward to using them for. Um, you know, I'd love to hear what your ideas are for the new content in the game. But as for me, eh, I can do without it.